beginner trapping series here we're going to show you how these traps actually work and and to show you the ease that you can have with getting these basically set in the field this is the Duke 550 uh, it's double base plated so it's a really strong trap it's center base swivel it's going to give that animal of complete range of motion it's also end swiveled to give another range of motion and that's one of the things that I like about these traps they're very friendly on the animal they're going to be uh, offset which has that gap in there that's also easy on the animal uh, big pan it's got a posi trip pan and you're gonna hear that click when I set it uh, now these are two coiled you can four coil them if you want I really don't feel it's necessary uh, but this is the Duke 550 uh, for you Western guys that maybe are getting into trapping because you want to uh, go after coyotes you may go for the 650 a bigger trap um, but predominantly across the board I recommend the 550 and as you can see here you're gonna push down on these levers and when you do that these jaws come down and that's where uh, the trap is gonna be set you take the dog and you're putting that over and you pull the pan up Now, as you see when I do that that pan is not level but what's really good about this trap is it's got that posi trip pan system. You put your thumb underneath and you'll hear this click when I go to set it. That click right there, that now allows you to know that that is perfectly set, that pan is level, and now when an animal comes and steps on that, that pan's going to go off and you're going to have that animal. And these are just a fantastic trap. You can see uh, really the ease of setting these. And when you're out in the field, you know, I'm using my knee, but you can use the ground. There are certain setters on the market where you can actually use them for leverage to pull down. But you're basically just pulling down, up over, and get the pan up. You put your thumb underneath click that traps now set and ready to fire but that's the Duke 550 now that's predominantly what I'm going to be using anytime I'm out in the field chasing coyote fox bobcat those bigger predators now when it comes to the equipment that you're going to need if you make any water sets pocket sets bridge sets uh, trail sets leading from a cornfield down into a ditch or uh, a, you know a trail that's heading out into your soybeans and these raccoons are causing you uh, a problem with your yield where they're destroying your crops these are uh, the double jaw dukes that I use in all of those situations. Uh, I like the double jaw because it's got a double jaw actually welded underneath, which means if that animal gets caught in there, they can't get in there under that foot and they're going to be here the next day. Now it also has a swivel on the trap here on the side and it also has an end swivel as well, so it's giving those animals a chance to move. This is going to be set the same exact way. Now this doesn't have the posi uh, pan system, so you're not going to be able to have that click but you're still pushing down the levers of your jaw and then you're getting the pan up like that now that's this trap is brand new um, we're going to get into trap prep in another uh, one of our beginner series is here coming up and I'm going to show you how we're going to level that pan now this is a brand new trap so that pan's not level but that's the premise of how you are going to set these traps pretty much the same as uh, the other traps the 550s uh, it's just you don't have the posi uh, trip system, but we're going to show you how that pan will be level by just working the screw and the nut on this. But that's the one and a half that you'll use in most of those water situations. Now, for you guys out there that are wanting to chase nest raiders or help yourself take those coons out of the equation because they're eating all your deer feed or farmers you're having them getting your corn and, and creating uh, crop circles uh, we're going to recommend that uh, you can put a lot of these in the ground and that's the duke dog proof and the duke dog proof is just a fantastic piece of equipment that is designed to catch every nest raider coming by 
whether it's a raccoon, a possum, or a skunk, they have those tangible fingers, and this trap is exactly what you want. Now, this has a three uh, swivel system. It's got the, the ring swivel on the stake. It's got the mid swivel and an end chain swivel. These are also very easy to set. You're just pulling back on the lever. The trigger goes down. It goes in the notch, and that's set already. And the animal's gonna come, your bait's gonna be in the cylinder. They'll reach down in, pull up on the trigger, the trap goes off, and they're there the next morning. But these are just a fantastic device as well. And as you can see, it doesn't take much to set them. There are setters available for these for uh, to be used as well, but you can see, once you get this down, it's not that hard, you're just pulling that back, you get the trigger down in the notch, and it's set already, and, and, and quite honestly, these things are a, a lifesaver when it comes to taking a lot of these raccoons and problem animals out of your equation because this is a fantastic device that you can set around your barns, your sheds, your houses, uh, being dog proof. Uh, those dogs and stuff are not going to get down in there and pull up on that trigger and they're going to work for you in all those situations. But really, quite honestly, when it comes to any critters out there that are causing you problems or you want to get into trapping uh, to get some furs to tan and, and pelts to give away and things like that, these three traps right here, uh, I call them the big three in my mind. You have the 550 for the coyote, fox, bobcat situations. You got the one and a half double jaw for all your water situations. And you got uh, the dog proof, which is going to work for you in all your nestrator situations. So I hope that uh, shows people out there the uh, way you can set these and, and the ease of setting them. Uh, it's not something that you need to be overwhelmed or nervous about. Uh, the 550, the one and a half double jaw, the dog proof is going to be the main three, the big three that's going to help you become the steward of your own land. And there's nothing better than after a uh, hunting season, extending your hunting season with these devices, giving you a chance to continue your outdoor lifestyle and in the same process, become the steward of your own land and create an environment that's uh, ecologically and environmentally sound through these trapping practices. So if you have any questions, feel free to reach out to us. But uh, these three devices are gonna help you be successful next time you go in the field.